This is an old Oshkosh front discharging concrete mixer, circa 1983. By the way, Oshkosh still does make front discharging cement mixers. I just don't see them that often. This is probably hands down the oldest one I've seen in person. But apparently this one's being used as a kind of a billboard advertisement for local company. I was looking at this a few days ago. Didn't really get a good look. But yeah, screw it. Looks like he's got old Cummins in it. Yeah. Old Cummins. I don't know what kind of what kind of engine specifically this is. Not too good. Don't know too many makes and models of uh, Cummins. So I'm not as familiar with the Cummins lines of engines as I am with the Cats and the Detroits. It's possible this truck could have been still in operation when I was just a little kid, but highly unlikely. Yeah, it's definitely seen better days. Somebody has left the window rolled down, either the window's broken, one of the two. Yeah, the window's broken. But yeah. What surprises the hell out of me is this thing's actually got a stick shift transmission. There's hardly any room in this damn cab, yet yeah, it's got a stick shift, huh? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if this would be a Oshkosh S400 or what it'd be. Again, I'm not too familiar with the Oshkosh line of trucks, but I know Oshkosh nowadays they they uh, make uh, military equipment like the Oshkosh Hemets for the U.S. Army. There's only one concrete company in town that I know of that uses Oshkosh, and that's uh, Pete Lean and Sons. Everybody else uses just regular rear discharging cement mixers. I don't know. Like I said, I have an appreciation for older trucks. I know these aren't exactly rare, but. Yeah, they're not that common, I'll tell you that much.